What is up, everybody? Hey, here. Everyone that's new, I'm a content creator. Um, I want to start off this video by saying that I'm not fulfilled with any of the content I've been putting out for the past year. I'm not fulfilled with any of it. I'm not happy with it. And I want to let y'all know why. I want to start off by saying that God places different desires in your heart at, like, he. it's crazy how he can just... Like one minute you want something and then like the two months later you don't want to do that anymore. And it's cause that's not that's not that's not no longer a desire that he has in your heart. And streaming and creating content has been one of my a desire of mine since I was like, I don't know how but I started making content when I was like what, seventh grade? Like I've been posting videos on this YouTube channel since I was in seventh grade. Seventh grade. You can't see them though. They're all like deleted or um not on, or uh private. They're private or not up. But I've been making content since seventh grade, and that's been like my passion. Like it's still my passion, but this is the how I wanna these past four months, all the content I've been putting out and put, putting up, not what I wanna do. The way I've been creating content is not how I wanna post my content anymore. I don't have the desire to entertain and be that kind of because the way my streams go if you guys watch me on twitch twitch.tv slash train you but if you watch me on twitch you know that i have like i'm more like a i be playing a game i watch videos i do e-dates i do stuff in my uh discord with my community but it's it's none of my content has substance let's put it that way like you can't you can't watch a trade video and learn something from Trey. Like you don't learn anything. Like you just come by and you might laugh and giggle and then click off and go to the next video. But you you're not you, you don't take nothing from my video. The whole reason why I started creating content was I wanted to get big enough to where I can switch my content. But why would I do that? Because let's say if I did get built if I had a million subscribers and I got it off of dumb stuff like doing the stuff I'm doing now and I did the whole 360 not many people would stick around and watch me when I can just start doing that now and then build that audience of people who actually want to watch videos like that. So the way I was going about it was totally wrong and it's not fulfilling and it's like, how do I word it? It's like I was losing, it's like I was losing a piece of myself every time I booted up a stream or made a video because every time I turned the cameras off, I didn't feel fulfilled, man. I'm going to keep it a book. I didn't feel fulfilled at all. Like, and, and it, it, it's crazy because this year has been like the greatest year that I've ever, like my greatest year of making content. I hit 20K on Twitch this year and it's been less than a year. I, I hit 20K on Twitch less than a year. I have 4,000 on YouTube, 5K on Twitter, no 5K on Instagram and like another 2,000 on Twitter. And like I had 80K on TikTok before I sold it. So this year, this been like my greatest year of creating content. But it's also been my worst year of creating content because, yes, all this the content I've been posting, been getting all these views and oh my gosh, like thousand views every video. I'm averaging like 150 people in my streams when I was streaming consistently in the summertime. I was averaging like 150 people in my streams. I was going crazy on my TikTok. Like every time I was getting like 10k to 20, 30k views on my TikToks, I was going crazy. But it's like every time I turned it off, like the, when I saw the views, I'm looking at the views. I'm like, oh God, yeah, that, that's like, I'm happy. But as soon as, as soon as this phone like cut off, as soon as that phone cut off, I don't feel filled as in like, I still feel empty with my content. When it comes to content, I still feel empty. And I didn't get the answers till last night. And I know why. It's because the content I've been creating isn't what, isn't holy. And especially the past year the past the past year of my life about a year i've been trying to live right righteously which is through christ i've been trying to live righteously through christ and this constant i've been putting out isn't the whole it ain't, it ain't holy at all it ain't god looking probably looking at my content now like what is he doing like the, the content i've been putting out i hate to cuss because i don't want to cuss in the video but my time it was bullshit like, yeah, I took my time with my content. I take my time on all my videos, but it's bullshit content, as in, like, you can't get nothing from it. Like, let me compare myself to another content creator. Let's say I snap, the biggest streamer in the world right now. 
Yeah, he's funny, he's entertaining, but his content holds no substance, his content holds no weight. You can't learn anything from Kai. You can't go to a Kai stream or a Kai video and learn something from it, which is not a problem at all. That's that's his content, and he's funny. He does. He's a, an amazing streamer. But where I'm at in my life, I want to, the videos I want to post and put out, I want people to look at a trade video and take something from it, like gain something from it. Like you watch a trade video and you learn this, this, that, a third, and it, and you laughed a little bit. Like, you laugh a little bit, but you learned something. I want to have a healthy balance when it comes to my content. Like, you learn and you laugh with my videos. Not just you laugh, 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 laugh. I want you to the next laugh, laugh, laugh. Like, I don't want... I don't want... I want to... I want to be more of a hopeful channel. As in, like, it's always... One of my desires is to be hopeful. Um, I like helping people. I like giving people advice. I like helping people learn new things. I like helping people look at life at, at different, at, in different aspects, like look at it in another's perspective, look at life in different perspectives. I don't just want to make you laugh. I want you to learn something from me. And that's why every time I, I'll start posting for a month. If you watch me consistently, you know, I, I'll go crazy for like a month or two. I'm streaming every day. I'm posting videos once a week. I'm going crazy on constant. Like, views is up. All my views is up. I'm having fun. It looks like I'm, from watching the camera, it looks like I'm having, like, a, a blast making content, which I am. But once this comes off, it's, I feel empty. Like, the content I post is not what I want to, I don't want, that's not what I want to post, pretty much. I'll put it that way. I don't want to post that content. And I appreciate every single last follow I had, subscriber, um, I appreciate everything. I hit 20K in less than a year. I have 25,000 plus supporters. 25,000 plus on all my socials. Binding all my socials together. 25,000 people is a lot of people, y'all. I'm going to put a demonstration of how many, like, what it looks like to look at 20,000 people. That's a lot of people, bro. That is a lot of people. And I appreciate every last one of y'all. But if I'm being brutally honest with myself, I don't respect anything... I don't respect the way I went about hitting my milestones. Yes, those are great milestones, but the way I went about hitting 20K, 10K, 5K, 1K, ain't respectable. And I know I'm better than that. I'm, I'm way better than that. I don't gotta, I don't need to follow trends and I gotta do this, this, that, the third so I can get views. I don't need to do that. And like I said, this video might not get that many views as the rest of my content have been getting, but numbers don't define numbers don't define me numbers don't define how good my content is numbers don't define any of that it's just it's going to take me some time to build my audience another a different core audience and if you guys really rock with me you'll you you you'll watch me people who really rock with trey will watch me still but all that dumb like that i'm just gonna say all that bs i've been posting and streaming it's no longer I want you to gain something from me. I want you to learn something from me. I still want you to laugh a little bit. Of course, I want you to laugh. You know, still want to be entertaining, but I want to have a balance between entertaining and learning. Because I have a lot to say. I have a lot to tell people. And I know a lot of people are will be willing to listen to me and see life in this perspective, in my perspective. Oh, I messed up that word. We'll see life in my perspective, and that's that's how I wanna. That's what I wanna do now. Like, and I feel like like this happy this video right now I'm making right now is fulfilling me right now. Like I'm, I have I'm, I actually want to make this video, and I'm gonna put a video on the screen. Like this is one of the videos on my screen that's on my channel right now, that made me fulfilled. It fulfilled me. It didn't get that many views, but I was I was I was like I really like. If you watch that video, you you y'all you, know, you can learn. People can learn something from that video. But the content I'm posting, like Fortnite one v ones or E Day video or streaming E Days and stuff. Nah, I don't wanna. I don't wanna be a part of that crowd no more. I wanna I wanna make my own lane and and ride that lane. If you rock with me, you rock with me. If you don't, you don't. But that that old tray, I'm hanging it up. Throwing that in the trash. Don't want anything to do with that one no more. I appreciate every follow, but I don't respect the way I got the follows. Put it that way. 
and starting from here on out you're going to start learning stuff from my videos yes it's still going to be entertaining of course but it's not just going to be all laughing and giggles because i want to i want to be i want to be a positive figure in the world and the content i post ain't really positive it's not negative in a way but it ain't you don't look at it and be like oh he's a great stand-up guy because you know I don't know how to I don't know how to I don't know how to word any of it. Just know that I want to be more of a a teacher in the world. Not not just a nigga making people laugh because I don't wanna I don't want my life to just be making everyone laugh. I want you to learn something from me. I have a lot to say. So if you guys rock with me, make sure you subscribe to the video. Subscribe if you're new, and if you rock with me, subscribe. Share this video because this this goes for anything in life. If you're not fulfilled with it, stop doing it. Everything you do in life should fulfill you, and you shouldn't feel empty afterwards. And my content made me feel empty. So subscribe, share the video with people, share the video with anybody. Um, turn on notice because I'll be trying to post every week. And uh, yeah, I think that's about it. That's all I had to say today. So...